J. Divas. I have a wig review for you today. I hope everyone's doing well. I hope you all are doing fine and you're staying safe. And guess what? This is it here. I'm not really sure if I like this. Um, To me, I, I don't know why. I think it's probably a little too, too short for me. But, um, but nevertheless, uh, I do like the color, but like I said, I just think it's probably a little short, too short, or I probably need to man manipulate a little bit more to suit me. And I don't want to do a whole lot of manipulation to it because I really just want to give it away. Uh, the color, um, the color is okay, but I don't know if this is something I would want to wear on a regular basis. But you may like it. And if you do, guess what? Email me at lejdesign2020 at gmail.com. And I'll send you this unit for free. For free. Let's look at the stock card. Here we go. It's uh, by Sensational is the name of the brand. And of course, here it is here in a 1B, which it looks really gorgeous on the model. Uh, and I love the way the bang is and the way the curls fall. And it does pretty much just that. Uh, but I don't particularly care for it. It just, to me, when it looks smooth like that on my face, because as you can see, more of her eyebrows and face is exposed. And so, you know, it, it looks a little bit more natural. To me, it just makes me feel like I have on a helmet. But uh, as far as the wig cap goes, the wig cap, I have it tightened, of course, as far as it can go. And it feels a little snug. It does feel tight. Matter of fact, it probably feels a little too tight because my head is starting to hurt a little bit. So I'd say the cap size is average. Is an av is for an average size head. If you have a large head, I don't think this one would be a good uh, good fit for you. But uh, here we go. The name of her is Anita. The color is a BG, which is, I'm sure it stands for burgundy because that's the color of it. It comes in a, a bunch of colors. Look, it comes in about eight different colors. It shows it on the back. It is a synthetic wig. Mostly all the wigs, of course, that I do are synthetic. Pretty much 99.9%. But it does say it's 100% premium fibers. And it basically gives you instructions as to how to wash it and how to, you know, give it, snap it back and uh, have it look really nice if you want to keep it for an extended period of time. I'm going to take this wig off so you all can see how she's constructed. I probably have it a little too tight because, like I said, it's, it was, it's feeling kind of snug on my head. It's kind of giving me a headache. But, um, which means the wig is rather snug. Okay. So let's start with the back of it. it. It does have combs, I should say. There's one comb in the back. There are two tabs there on the side. Hopefully you can see. And you see how far the tabs are. And that's tightening it up. I'm sure. Let me see. Uh, you might can tighten it a little more, but that's as far, you see, that's how I have it tightened about that far uh, with that width apart, and that feels really tight for me. I mean, to the point it was like giving me a headache, and I only had it on for about three minutes. So this cap may be a little small. It may be considered small for you if you have a lot of hair. Or you have large plaits, this probably won't work for you. I, I say it's average in that you can loosen it up some. But uh, again, like I said, for me, if it's hurting my head and it's that far apart, it may not be well for you if you have a lot of hair. All right. So this is the front part. It's another comb here in the front. Um. And let's see what else I want to tell you about this hair. It's not much to tell. I'm going to show you how it's constructed. See the small curl pattern that goes all the way around the, the wig. You know, of course, you can comb that out. 
or, you know, you can let it stay in there and just manipulate it just a bit so that you can make it your own. And I'm going to try not to manipulate it a lot so that in case somebody wants it, you know, you can do just that. So let me fold it back and try it on again. Um, please go to my Instagram page. I'm going to have several pictures of it where I've kind of switched, made like a little side part and stuff like that so that you can see how it looks. Kind of changing the front. Like I said, the stock card is made where the lady just kind of has all this curved around her forehead and she has it kind of smoothed down on the side to frame her face. I don't want to do a lot to this um, but like I say it's kind of cute I kind of like it when you know the hair kind of sticks up a little bit to me that's cute but like I say I don't want to play with it too much because somebody may want this right somebody may really like this and really want this but I love um, uh -uh -uh. it's not bad it's not bad it's not one of my favorites but it's it's not a bad look. Like I say, if you like short dudes, it's not a bad look. It's actually kind of cute. And I think if you make it your own and, you know, uh, manipulate it more to make it suit you, I think it would be really cute. I, that's one way. Of course, you know, I try kind of combing her down a little bit in the front, you know, uh, that's another way. Uh, I also try kind of making like a little side part and manipulating her like that. And that's another way of uh, changing the look up just a little bit in the front. Uh, and of course, you know, really messing some of these curls up where they kind of go in different directions, I think is a really cute look too. But I'm not going to do that. Like I said, I want to kind of keep it as best uh, in its natural state as I can, just in case somebody wants this. I'm going to turn around and let you see how she looks in the back. Okay. All right. All right. Tell me what you think. Comment, comment, comment. Remember, Leger Design 2020 at gmail.com. I'll send you this unit for free if you're interested in it. Just be one of my first timers. If you've never gotten a wig before, I would love to send you this unit. All my Leger divas, they already know what to do. Wait the 30 days. And if nobody has asked for it, of course, it's yours. So anyway, I wish you all well. Thank you, thank you, thank you for coming to my channel, subscribing. I appreciate all my new subscribers. Thank you so much for watching. And I thank you for those who email me uh, who have gotten wigs. I'm so glad that you appreciate it, and I'm so glad that you are enjoying them. Thank you so much. Have a good evening. Hey, I'm going to enjoy my birthday because this weekend is my birthday. So I wish you all well, and I will see you soon. Thank you. Bye.